Corsair Cat, home of brilliant children's books. Meow. Hello and welcome to another exciting episode. And today I'm going to be reviewing A Touch of Magic. Now, I found this book really good. Um, and uh, I hope you all like this book as well. Um, so I'm going to read the blurb. Let's have a look. Um, when Lauren's brother Max makes friends with two new boys, he forgets about looking after, after Buddy, his puppy. Lauren tries to hide it from their parents, knowing that if they found out, Max would get into a lot of trouble, and they might even send Buddy away. Can a touch of magic help to show Max how important Buddy really is? <laughs> So, have you guys had, had ever had any pets? I just like, me and my sister got a hamster and we love him so much and he's really cute. And we look after him as much as we can. So, he's a really lovely hamster and we love him very much. Now, if you guys have, have pets, it's really good to make time for them because pets are really important. They're like, your siblings but then you could be like their mother if you're looking after them but yeah pets are lovely so Max isn't looking after his puppy properly that's not good is it you always have to look after your pet because it's your responsibility so um, Lauren as a good big sister maybe not exactly telling the truth a lot has to well, hide it from her parents because she doesn't want her little brother to get told off. You can see how much she loves her little brother there. Now, you've heard of Buddy and Max in the last episodes of these books. So, um, yeah, so he's in there again with his dog. So he's not looking after his dog properly because he's getting distracted by lots of these boys. They're nice boys, they're his friends, but he wants to act all cool and everything, and he doesn't want Buddy ruining his, well, vibe and stuff. And he just doesn't, he just, it doesn't make time for him because, well, I don't know, he's too busy for him. That's not even, well, an excuse. So, Max isn't making much time for Buddy, but hopefully Max will realise how important Buddy is to him because pets are really important to you. I mean, they're your friends and you love them very much and you have to make as much time for them as possible. So do you think that Max will actually find out how really important Buddy is to him? You'll have to read the book and find out. So, yeah, um, Max... Um, wants, doesn't want to make much time for Buddy because he's too busy going over his friend's house. And it says in the book that his friends like skateboarding and that what, what was making him really addicted to skateboarding, I think. I mean, if he doesn't make much time for Buddy, that means he's, well, not caring at all. And his parents want him to feed Buddy and love him as much because they bought him for a reason. And, uh... Max isn't making much time for him at all, hardly ever feeding him, definitely not taking him out for walks, and dogs really need walks. And, well, Max just didn't really care that time because, well, he was with his friends and all cool and stuff. And he loves skateboarding and so does his friends, and he tries to show his friends how cool he can really be without even realising to care about bod bod body <laughs> buddy at all so that's not very good and Lauren is covering for him which is really nice but do you think Twilight and Lauren could help him well realize how important buddy is and as you know in all the books Twilight's a very magical unicorn a secret one and Lauren's magical friend is it magical friend? No, unicorn friend. Unicorn friend. So, um, Twilight is um, Lauren's unicorn friend. And, well, 
Buddy really loves Max, so he doesn't really, he wants him to make time for him as much as he can. But Max gets really annoyed, which is not very good. You want to make as much time for the pets as possible. So, I would give this book probably maybe four stars. It was a good book, but maybe not as really, really good as it could be. But it was good. I did enjoy it. And I hope you too, you all enjoy it as well. Um, thank you for watching. And don't forget to like, subscribe and click the bell. And you'll never miss another episode. Thank you for listening. Bye.